For the European Conservatives and Reformists, Mr. Callanan has the floor. Thank you, Mr. President. Um, I want to do two things uh, this morning. Um, first of all, um, I want to wish the Secretary General of the Parliament a very happy birthday. Uh, I'm sure he's delighted to be having to spend his birthday uh, listening to us drone on in this chamber. Uh, and secondly, of course, and much more importantly, I'd like to thank the... Uh, the <laughs> I'd like to thank the Danish presidency, uh, their officials and ministers, uh, all of those that, with whom we've dealt with over the last uh, six months. Uh, of course, uh, as a socialist and myself as a conservative, I'm sure, Prime Minister, that there are many issues on which we would disagree. Uh, however, I would like to pay tribute to the typical Danish efficiency and practicality which has been sorely needed uh, in the EU over the last uh, six months. Uh, in particular, your presidency should be congratulated uh, for burying the financial transactions tax as an EU-wide initiative. Uh, it would have damaged many of the EU's uh, financial centres uh, and many, of course, ordinary savers and investors as well. Um, your administration should also be thanked for refusing to reopen negotiations on the pregnant workers directive, which would have raised costs for businesses, reduced women's choice and made it harder for many young women to find jobs. And you should also be congratulated as a member of the EU Net Contributors Club for pushing for budget restraint uh, within the EU as well. In fact, when I look at many of the policy areas, it seems that there are many lessons that you could teach the wider socialist family about the responsibilities of power should you ever choose to come back to this parliament. Uh, regarding the row over the Schengen evaluation mechanism, uh, I have to say you have my sympathy uh, on this. After all, the decision to change the legal base was made unanimously by the Council, uh, a Council which Mr Dahl and others often remind us is made up predominantly of leaders of the EPP. Uh, so I think it's very unfair that the messenger should be shot uh, on this uh, incident. Uh, that aside, I think the Danish Presidency's uh, overall relationship with the Parliament has been extremely good uh, and I would like to thank in particular your Europe Minister sitting behind you, Mr Wammen, for all the work that he's done. He sat there tirelessly day after day in this chamber having to listen to uh, a lot of brickbats and criticisms. Uh, I think he's done it extremely well, extremely courteously and I'm sure he has a great future ahead in your government. Uh, Prime Minister, overall, your presidency, I think, has been a good, honest broker between the institutions, and we come away with a positive assessment of Denmark's time at the helm. Well done. Thank you.